joined now, live in studio, by Lacey Rain, the Hurricane. Yay. Lacey Rain, appearing at Blush, 9th Street, downtown, tonight and tomorrow night. Mm -hmm. Also, were there last night, right? I was there last night. How, how was it last night? Uh, it, the was, crowd? it was good. The crowd, the crowd was, they were, they were so funny. <laughs> every time I come to Pittsburgh and every time I come to Blush, I just, I love the crowd that you guys feed me. Yeah. Everybody's way into it and so excited and they're, they, you know, they screw with me too and it's awesome. I well, love it. I'm sure you help. You, you know, you're, you're one of the big names that comes in. That, that gets them excited. I'm that. a pot stirrer. I like to poke the button. <laughs> <laughs> So what, you, so what else did you do while you were in town? I just heard you say you've been here since Monday you guys got yeah. in. You went to the zoo yesterday, right? Yeah, do you remember what happened to me last time? Yes, I remember okay, what so happened to you last time you went to the zoo. Hey, you don't forget that kind of story. I wanted to see if you had any more weird I, I have, animal sex encounters this time. I have a conclusion. Okay. I, okay, and I did not know how long it took um, gorillas to conceive a baby, but we saw the baby that we saw them make. Get it's the heck out I'm of not here. even kidding you. It you was were only like, here like three months ago. No, back in July. It was that long ago? Yeah. It was in July? Yeah, it was like seven and a half, eight months ago. Okay, so I didn't know the gestation period of a girl either. either. I mean, so last time, for those of you who don't remember, last time Lacey was here, she had a great story <laughs> about going down to the zoo to watch the monkeys do it. I don't think that was exactly what she yeah, was going. She had videos. I had and video she videotaped it. dirty, it's weird, unanticipated gorilla sex that was on her YouTube channel. It was a three-way. It wasn't just, yeah. it wasn't just a one And you found out it was like a brother and sister yeah, gorilla, yeah. too, which made things yeah, a little oh, weird. Like, oh, the oh, interloper was a, was like a sister of the main participant. She was a, she I'm, was a backdoor supporter. I'm really <laughs> freaked out by how much of this gorilla story I remember from the last time you were here. How do you forget something like that? Exactly. Yeah, but I'm, they had a baby. And they and, and the result of that situation that you filmed that was on your YouTube stage. it was specific situation, it was definitely that week. Wow. I, I know. I can't believe it. The baby's five, five, six days old. Yeah. Wow. It's so cute, isn't it? I bet a, I bet a week old gorilla baby's pretty cute. Oh my gosh, it's adorable. I want one. You want a gorilla? I do. Actually, you know. Um... I don't think we've domesticated the gorilla. <laughs> Talking to the hurricane, Lacey Rain. The hurricane. Where'd you, where'd you get the, where'd you get the hurricane uh, nickname? That Who was... first saddled you with the nickname the hurricane? Um. And how well does it describe you? It, well, the DJ at my um, home club before I was a feature thought he was being a, a smart ass one day. Mm -hmm. And uh, he started calling me Lacey during the hurricane because we did this um, wrestling thing on stage with a bunch of the girls. And so we all came up with like funny names that sounded like wrestler names. So they were like, in this corner, weighing at 130 pounds, like spray the hurricane, right? And I came out and did the whole thing. It was cute. And um, then it kind of just stuck. And then uh, they would tease me when I was having like bad days or something. They'd be like, Lacey, you're in the morning breeze. <laughs> <laughs> or lazy drizzle. That was, that was something like that I had. The in. light mist. Uh, <laughs> the morning mist. <laughs> <laughs> like a summer breeze today. <laughs> so tell, tell us about where we can find more of your stuff. You do, you, you're, you tweet. I tweet a lot. Probably about things I shouldn't. You follow me on Twitter, right? Yeah. Like it's what? A politics. <laughs> Is that right? My opinions of rock bands. Yeah, that might be why I only have 600 followers. Because I'm kind of an asshole. Because <laughs> you get them and then they, they unfollow shortly? Probably. And I, I, get I, think a lot that of I had more at one point and then I started tweeting about politics and they just went right down I, Not a lot of people are going to their featured dancers' Twitter accounts to get political opinions. I'm just saying. I'm not saying that you should I'm stop very, doing it. It's your page. Know, you should do what so you want with it. I need to it. stop doing that. I'm just it's saying so that. Somebody actually uh, wrote to me one time, he's like, you know, you really need to stop doing that because you're losing a lot of your followers and uh, you're, you're upsetting a lot of your Republican fan base. And I was like, uh, I, I'm a stripper. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have Republican followers. Like, I, yeah. I have like closet Republican followers. Yeah. <laughs>